A customers of psychics gave her thousands of dollars to see their past, and now they're suing her. Now, this story is beyond bizarre, um, but this Manhattan psychic is being forced to recount um, their current lives, you know, in front of... This is crazy, right? So this particular psychic lady um, is asking all these women to fork over thousands and thousands of dollars so that she can go back and past and tell them about how was or how screwed up their is but if it's not true this is why i don't really believe in psychics personal lens like i never was down with miss cleo never did the psychic hotline none of it because it's just really it's hard to for somebody to both talk about your past and know your past but also to predict your future and my thing with the predicting the future stuff on this particular story is if somebody predicts your future and they say you're going to die or this is going to happen or that's going to happen in all likelihood you're going to try to modify your future you're going to try to alter your future that's why nobody knows the future because if you knew the future you would try to change the future it reminds me of the movie paycheck it came out a couple years ago with ben affleck um and i want to say i forgot the other person in the movie but it's all about how they can see the future and they try to alter it and change it and make it different um which is ut which is utterly and completely and totally impossible um and that movie just proves what i've been saying all along is that you just got to live for today um, not to get into a Richard Fowler moment, but live for today, and living for today means you don't fork over thousands and thousands of dollars to a crazy psychic in Manhattan.